Welcome to Keeping It Simple Crafts. I hope everyone's doing good. Today I have my little helper with me, Mr. Parker, and we are going to be decorating our Grinch Christmas tree that I picked up at Hobby Lobby. So are you ready to start decorating for Christmas? I cannot wait. So give me just a second and we'll get started. First, we're going to be starting with this garland that I picked up for less than $5 at Walmart. So I'm just going to take it, find a branch on the back, stick this little loop on it, twist the branch up, and then I am just going to kind of add a diagonal angle, loosely wrap the tree. Here's how the tree looks with all three strands of garland. I added three garlands from Walmart to the Grinch Christmas tree. Now I'm going to be adding my ribbon next. And this one says, you're a mean one. And I ordered it online from Craft Outlet. It is 2.5 inch width ribbon with wire. And I also ordered this one from Craft Outlet, 2.5 inch width ribbon with wire. So we're going to add ribbon next. We cut our ribbon in strips at 24 inches, mainly because of the saying on the ribbon, but you can cut yours longer if you would like. So I'm going to take my wired ribbon and just pinch it together, and I'm going to find a branch in the tree and just kind of gently twist the branch around the ribbon. Then I'm not going to pull it tight. I'm just gonna kind of pinch it together, find another branch, twist it in, Keep going down the tree and you can do it at an angle if you want or however you would like and just don't pull it too tight and you'll want to dovetail your ends and just kind of flare them out we cut this strip at about 24 inches same steps I'm going to pinch it together and I'm going to kind of go at an angle also, so I'm just going to wrap a branch around the ribbon, give it a little twist, and we'll kind of try to go in the same direction as the uh, You're a Mean One ribbon. And this one's only going to go not too far, so I'm going to just add strips on this little tree and don't pull it tight, and then flare out your end or your tail. Next, I'm going to tie a small bow for the top of my Grinch Christmas tree. So I don't want to let out a long tail for this one, but since I don't have a table, I'm going to go ahead and drop this to the floor and just leave about four inches, pinch it together, and then I'm going to make a loop, and this is about a four inch loop. And then I'm going to make another loop the same size on the other side, pinch it in the middle, Try to make your loops the same size on each side, and you'll want to use ribbon with wire. Then we're going to make another loop. Check to make sure your loops are the same size. Okay. Just hold it tight in your hand. So I have two loops on the left, two loops on the right. Okay, can I have a zip tie please? Then I'm going to take a zip tie, wrap it nice and tight around the center of my bow. And this is much easier on the table instead of doing it in the air. Pull your zip tie tight. Then let me cut off this end. Thank you. Then we're gonna dovetail it. Fold your tail in half with the edges to the left 
go to the folded side, cut away from the fold. That makes the pretty V. Let me cut this off too. Then let's fluff our loops. Okay, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to, on the back, I'm going to take a piece of floral wire, thread it underneath the zip tie, and then that way I can attach my bow right in this area or maybe a little bit further down to my tree. Next, I'm going to be adding these adorable Christmas light bulb picks that I picked up at Walmart. Make sure before you start decorating your Christmas tree that you really fluff your Christmas tree. So we first started with the three garlands from Walmart. Then we added ribbon, a bow, and now we're adding our picks and these adorable Grinch picks. I ordered them online from Craft Outlet and they just scream Grinch to me. They're so cute and whimsical. And then afterwards, I'm going to be adding my bigger items. That would be where you would add, like if you wanted to add some bigger like Christmas ornaments, or I am going to be adding some poinsettias that I picked up at Walmart. Since this Grinch Christmas tree is such a fun shape, I wanna keep everything fun and whimsical. So I am going to be adding my poinsettias. I just picked up three of them at an angle. A week or so ago, I did a holiday shopping haul video that I will link in the description box and it tells all about most everything that's on this tree and the prices too. If you'd like to check that one out, I can link it in the description box. And then this pretty gold star Christmas ornament came from Walmart and I just thought it was perfect for the very end. My daughter found that for me. Last, I'm going to be adding my smaller Christmas ornaments, and most all of them came from Walmart. At the very end, I decided I wanted to add some more fun, whimsical picks to this Grinch Christmas tree. So these are some pompous grass or feather picks that I ordered online from Craft Outlet. And then I'm just adding a few more shatterproof Christmas ornaments from Walmart. I know this Christmas tree is not everyone's style and taste, but I just thought it was so fun and whimsical for Christmas, and my kids and I just love watching the Grinch movie every Christmas. So I hope you enjoyed watching me decorate my Grinch tree. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, share it, 
leave me a comment. And if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, I would love to have you as a subscriber. I share lots of budget-friendly DIYs, shopping hauls, shop with me videos, decorating videos, and all of that kind of fun stuff. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope everyone has a Merry Christmas.